Hey guys, this is Kamiguno, and today I'm doing a one on one video on Scarlet Witch. And the person who recommended this was Comic Book Fan 1992, just in time for the release weekend of Avengers Age of Ultron, the introduction of Scarlet Witch into the MCU. Uh, but I want to talk about some key books that I feel like you should read if you want to get into Scarlet Witch, uh, Scarlet Witch's character. And of course, the first two I think you should definitely read is Avengers. There's a ton of Avengers titles she's in uh, because she really is one of the, the main people, the core members of the Avengers, but of course the Avengers team's always switching up. Uh, but she's also a part of the West Coast Avengers, so you can read that too. She's a little bit more of a lead there, so uh, West Coast Avengers, recommend that. Um, also, she is a mutant, so you, you get to see some X-Men stories with her, but again, I do feel you you do get more Avenger stories with Scarlet Witch, because you see her more as the hero than the villain, and then the villain again, and then a hero again, so she's always going back and forth. But usually, there's more time period that she's the hero. Uh, but a most important, I would say, Scarlet Witch story ever um, is House of M, where she says no more mutants, and she almost makes mutants extinct. So that is a very important story. Uh, again, I, I would say that's probably the most iconic story for Scarlet Witch. That's why I have the no more mutants thumbnail, uh, because that, that really is a big story for her. Uh, so other titles you should read, these are a bit more current titles, uh, one I always recommend you should read just in general, but uh, Avengers The Children's Crusade, you get to see her relationship with her sons, um, Speed and, and Wiccan, so totally recommend that story. And this is also the aftermath of House of M, how do they people see her, so uh, definitely read Children's Crusade if you want to learn more about that. Um, after that you have Access, which I don't really recommend, but it is a story progression for um, for Scarlet Witch, so that's why you should read it, uh, because we see that they changed that she's not the daughter of Magneto somehow. They changed that. I didn't actually read the issue, but I know that's what happens there, so don't recommend it, but if you want to learn everything about Scarlet Witch, you should read it. Um, and currently, in, in a lot of... Um, the Marvel Now stuff she's been in is Uncanny Avengers. So if you read Uncanny Avengers, I don't know if she's in the current Uncanny Avengers. I know she was in the last Unca Uncanny Avengers and she was a main character. And again, dealing with, um, you know, becoming a hero again. Uh, I definitely recommend that series. So those are all the series I recommend for Scarlet Witch. I feel like are the big stories to read. Uh, hope Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Of course, I'll have another one-on-one -on -one video next week. This is Comic Uno and Comic Frontline. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, in the description below, there's links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. I'll see you guys later. Bye.